video I'm going to show you how you can install um, GeoTools to work on your IntelliJ IDE. It, it, there is, well, there's a guide um, online which you can basically piggyback on, which is a docs GeoTools org. However, I found it a little bit tricky to follow all the steps, so I think a visual video probably helps out a little bit. So let's get started. First thing you got to do is create a new project. Again, I'm using IntelliJ IDE to, to do that. So I'm going to open up my IntelliJ IDE. And I'm ver using the version 20, 20, 1, 2. And I'm just going to create a new project. In the create new project, I'll make sure that I'm choosing on my left window pane Maven and in Maven I am going to choose uh, an archetype. The archetype that I want to have is the Apache Maven archetype quick start. Okay, just going to call this tutorial. And the artifacts coordinates, I'm going to use the ones that they suggest in the GeoTools tutorial. So here we go, which are org GeoTools um, tutorial. Oh, well. um, and next, bundled Maven 3. It's so, all right, good, good, good. And finish. Okay. Now this will start to create your first framework and foundation for your GeoTools. But there are a couple of changes we need to do, especially in the palm, so that we can load all the things. And um, let's first see if the app would work. So we go to the tutorial, to the source, main, Java, and you'll have your app here. Right click on it, run app. And if everything is fine and dandy, you should have the message, hello world, cool. Taking us to the next step, we are now um, editing it from charts, and here it's where it becomes a bit more tricky. So what you have to do is basically go to your palm file. So here and start adding some things. For instance, in the properties, you have to have the GeoTools properties here added. So instead of copying, copying all of that, what I would suggest in Bordeaux for me was just copy these two lines and add them to the existing properties over here. So you have the Maven compiler and you've got your GeoTools version. Okay. And um, also these. So, oh, sorry, I've already added this. Okay, we're good. Dependencies, you have got all of these dependencies to add. So make sure that you add from this to this. Um, and it would start here with the other dependency which you already have in your predefined project. So you've added all of the dependencies here. Okay, and then you gotta call the external repositories so that we can load GeoTools to it. Okay, so repositories, which we don't have here any part yet. So make sure that you add it after your dependencies. I just like to keep a double space. So there is sort of a clear distinction. Well, space is enough. What is the next line? So things that I'm adding to it. I'm just going to save my project real quick. Command S or to go to save. Oh, all right. 
So to get off this, I'm just going to go here to right click the palm XML, Maven, and um, download sources and doc documentation. Okay, which I think should be automatic, but I'm not sure. So. Okay, so let's go with the, with the application itself. So we can start our GeoTool application. So that's basically the quick start application that we're going to do here. Right click and on our GeoTools new Java class. And I'm just going to call it exactly what we have here. Tutorial, quick start, quick start. Press enter. Here it is. And I'm just going to copy the code here, all of it. Save it. And if you were like me, you would have the mistake that it gives sort of lots of errors because it really didn't load all of the ArcGeo tool packages. And that's where I lost a little bit of time with. So the way I actually made it work was with reload the project. And when I reloaded the project, it basically resolved all of dependencies. Okay. And um, and then just restart. Okay, again, it's still running from the app here. So just right click on your quick start and run quick start main. And there it is. Now it's working fine. Obviously, we do need some data because I think that basically what this quick start allows you to do is um, to to get a shape file in in a small window so you can download the sample data from the natural earth data website whoops okay just follow along i've already downloaded the data so i've got it on my desktop and then I just go to users. Desktop. And here's my data. Um, uh, countries, for instance. Okay. Open. And there it is. So you're now visualizing your quick start GeoTools in Java Maven. It comes with a series of predefined buttons. So let's try to zoom a little bit to shapefile. Okay, it's pretty cool. Good. All right. 